Most of us wish we could retire early, but for most of us, that dream stays just that, a dream. But some lucky people are able to escape the shackles of the job market at a young age, which begs the important question, how in the hell did they do it? Well let's find out. Shall we first decide what your retirement means? Now, each person or family has a different idea of what early retirement means. Some people have to do the least amount of work, while others have to do no work at all. So, the first step to retiring early is to figure out what retirement means to you. Once you know what it means to you, you can plan what to do next. Having a clear idea of what retirement means to you will help you make decisions about your life and change how you see and think about money. If you think of retirement as the time when you do the least amount of work, you will probably keep working, especially if you want to stay busy with something important. But if all you want to do in retirement is sleep in and spend time with your family and friends, you've got a lot of work to do. Plan for your health. It's easy to forget to plan for your health, but you should. When you think about plans to retire early, you usually think about money and where you'd like to go on vacation. No matter what you do, though, you should always plan for your health. In fact, the best way to go is to have a good emergency fund. This way, you'll be ready for any sudden health problems that could ruin your plans for retirement. If you also want to retire early, it's important to take care of your health as a young person. You may have heard of the acronym EAR which stands for exercise, always eat well, and rest when you need to. Keep this acronym in mind at all times, and it will help you stay healthy in a lot of ways. It's also a good idea to have health insurance. Don't forget that if you retire early, you won't be covered by your employer's health insurance plan anymore. Sign up for your employer's retirement savings plan. You might not know it, but your employer probably has a 401k plan. There is a retirement plan or something similar. Signing up for it is all you have to do. OK. But let's be honest, your employer's retirement savings plan won't help you retire early on its own. In fact, these savings plans are meant to help you retire when you're older, because that's when the money you've saved starts to add up. But before you pass up this chance, you should ask yourself, what do I have to lose? Yes, that's right, nothing at all. So, why don't you just do it? 4. Know and plan where you will live when you retire early. If you plan to retire early, you should already have a housing plan in place. If you don't, now is the time to start thinking about it. For most people, planning their retirement home means paying off the mortgage on that home. For others, it means making major repairs or changes. For others, it means getting a new home in that country or city they've always dreamed of. Whatever it is, it's important that you start making plans now. Fifth, if you want to retire early, you should know that you can't retire from a salary job, no matter how much you make. It's almost impossible to retire from a salary job. If you want to retire early, you need to make the tough choice to go the extra mile. Sixth, 
Be disciplined with your money. This could mean having a side business or investing in high return assets like real estate. Can you retire early without getting better at managing your money? Of course not. If you want to retire early, you need to make important decisions about your money right now. Do you spend a lot of money on clothes, new gadgets, and takeout food? Well, that should all change right now if you want to have enough money for retirement. We know what you're thinking, it's only a few hundred dollars, it shouldn't matter. Well it does matter. And if you don't make the right changes to your money now, you might not have anyone else to blame but yourself in the long run. Change your lifestyle if you're serious about retiring early. Most of the time, the decision to retire early requires a certain amount of hard work and discipline. And if you're not willing to put in the work or make the sacrifices, your plans to retire early might be nothing more than a pipe dream. Changing your lifestyle usually means stopping doing certain things or putting more of your income into savings. For example, let's say your annual family vacation costs you a total of $10,000. Well, why don't you cut that in half and put the other half into a savings plan? Now, you'd have to choose a cheaper vacation spot, but you'd also have $5,000 more in your savings. Sounds like a win to us. Number 8. Know where you stand with your money right now. How do you plan to get where you want to go? If you don't know where you stand financially, it's just as important to know where you are as it is to have a plan for retiring early. If you don't know where you stand financially, you might be wondering how to understand your financial situation. Well, we've come up with a short list of questions for you. Start by asking yourself, what is my current annual income? How much do I have saved? How much money do I have in my account for a rainy day? How much do I need to pay back? How can I lower my living costs while keeping a good standard of living? When you finally figure out the answers to these questions, you'll know more about your finances and what you need to do to retire early. Number 9, Put Money Into Learning About Money We said at the beginning of the video that for many people, retiring early sounds like a far-off dream, but we hope you're starting to see. It's a reasonable and attainable goal. But it's almost never possible to retire early if you don't know much about money. What is the one thing that all retirees don't have in common? It's important to have a lot of knowledge about money. Take the time to learn about saving, taxes, businesses, insurance, and even what it means to retire. Don't be afraid to start learning about money. There are a lot of helpful things to find in number 10. One of them is putting your future ahead of your present. This really can't be said any other way. But if you want to retire early, you have to put your future ahead of what you need right now. It's just how things are. For example, an anonymous blogger who writes for a purple life, said that they had to switch jobs, several times to save more money. They were able to increase their salary by $20,000 by doing this. This blogger also said that moving out of their city to a different state helped them cut their costs by almost 50% and raise their standard of living. 
Now, it must have been hard to deal with all these job changes. Moving to a different state is scary for everyone. But this blogger had their sights set on retiring early, so it didn't bother them to go through these hard times. Number 11. Save as much as you can. When it comes to saving money, the earlier you start, the better. But there is one thing we all do to save money. We save the amount that feels right to us, not the most we can afford. For example, we'd rather save 10% of our income each month, even though we can easily save 20%. Early retirees have to make the hard decision to save as much as they can, because that's the only way they can save enough to live their dream retirement lifestyle. Find your target number, at the beginning of this video, we talked about why it's important for you to define what retirement means to you. But you know what's even more important than having a number in mind for retirement? Grant Sabater retired early and made a million dollars. Here's what he says you should do to make money. He says that your goal number should be 25 to 30 times the amount you expect to spend each year. You can put this amount in savings or in your investment portfolio. He also tells people who want to retire early to have at least one year's worth of expenses in cash. Do you think this method will help you reach your goal number? We have financial advisors and planners to help us out, so it's fine if you can't make it. Number 13, start your own business. What do you think about making money? Do you just see it as investing and saving, or as a business in its own right? Most millionaires see it as a business. And this is what makes them different from other people. You can't just ignore your investment portfolio and wait for it to pay off sometime in the future. You have to treat it consistently like you would a business. Think of ways to improve this portfolio and keep an eye out for new and better opportunities. But building your business requires more than just money. Why don't you set up your business in a way that lets you earn money without doing anything? Sounds like a great plan, right? Number 14, learn about risk management. You're planning to retire early and also building wealth through a good investment plan. But investing is a risky way to get rich, and if you don't manage it early on, you could lose everything you've worked for. There are many ways for people to protect themselves against financial risks, such as diversifying their portfolios and choosing their assets with care. But even though we need strong investment portfolios, that doesn't mean we should only invest in safe assets. Remember that taking risks is what makes a person who gets things done different from someone who takes the easy way out. Number 15, make a plan. You know what retirement means to you now, so make a plan. You have a goal number, a portfolio of investments, a savings plan, health insurance, a savings account for emergencies, and the mindset to retire early. The next step is to write down a detailed plan of everything you need to do now until the day you become a full return. We really think you should talk to a professional financial advisor to make sure this plan is foolproof, and there you have it. Here are 15 interesting tips to help you retire early. Do you think you can handle this challenge? 
Well, we think you might be, and if you've been watching this video up to this point, you should get a raise and your bonus. Here's another tip for getting out of work early. Number 16. Don't forget to have fun in the here and now. When you want to retire early, it can be easy to get lost. You might worry so much about what will happen next. Take a deep breath. You forget what it means to enjoy the present. You're doing fine, so have fun with the time you have now. When you finally stop working, you'll remember them with a lot of love. Now. Do you have any tips that you'd like to share with the community about all of this? Because if you know, please tell us in the comments. Thank you for spending today with us. We're so glad you did. If you liked today's video, please hit the like button, click the bell to make sure you never miss a new one, and don't forget to subscribe.